Good morning. So I'm actually feel like I'm sick. I woke up with such a bad headache. My throat was killing, and I was really like, like not snotty, but you know, like a bit congested. And I kind of sound like it's still like like in my nose and stuff. And I can't decide whether I'm actually getting sick or if it's like hay fever or something. I guess we will find out. Um. So. Most of you will know if you are a Harry Potter fan or Fantastic Beasts fan. I didn't know that that was a thing, that some people hate Harry Potter but love Fantastic Beasts. Apparently that's a thing, which is ridiculous because it's the same world and basically the same thing, just set, set before Harry Potter. But then I can kind of understand how you might not like Harry Potter, but you enjoy Fantastic Beasts. I don't know. I can kind of understand, but then at the same time I can't. Anyway. It actually came out yesterday, the second film of a five film instalment. Shut up, I need to blow my nose. Where was I? Yeah, so it came out yesterday, and today Tom, Caitlin, Reese, and I are all going to go watch it. We purchased some tickets last night, so I'm so excited. There actually wasn't much space left in the cinema, but I'm not surprised because it only came out yesterday. Um, so, I'm so excited. And then this afternoon I have a doctor's appointment and Tom's gonna meet me there. Um, and then I'm either gonna go pick up the syringes and stuff from the hospital before or after, I haven't decided yet. I don't know what's the time. I'm gonna have to leave soon if I'm gonna do it before, but I think I'll most likely do it after, but I'm not, time, I'm not sure what time the clinic closes because it's like the patient equipment center. I'm not sure what time that closes. That's where I have to go pick him up from. So, and then tonight, probably after the film, I would say, because that'll be quite late. But then we will have to set my TPM up when we get home from the film. I'm not doing it before. Um, we have to do a stock take, which is this. Um, so basically, if I'll come, sh I'll show you my drawers right now because they're kind of a bit bare. So that's the top drawer. That is literally all we've got in there at the moment. Um, and pretty much like that's the same for like all of this. Like there's still got quite a few giving sets, not that many dressing packs. Ivy fluids, I only stocked that the other day, so we're alright for those really. Um but yeah, we need to do a stock take and then we're gonna fill up the drawers tonight because we've got a load of stock in this bedroom here. This is like a little, I don't even know what you call it, but we've got a load of stock stuff. So we're going to stock that in the drawers and then we'll see what stock we have left and then we'll fill out the chart. And then tomorrow my Baxter ring, like, rings me and they'll be like, okay, what do you need? And I'll be like, oh, I need however many of this and however many of that. But it makes it a lot easier for me if we've already filled out that stock thing, so... Oh gosh, this weather is killing me. Like seriously, the last two days it's gotten so, so hot. And last night I was so, so unwell. Like, I passed out like three times. My blood pressure was ridiculously low. And I had to run like double fluids back to back. So it was a stressful time. But normally I would have had to go to the hospital. So I'm so glad that I could have, I managed it at home. So yeah. Anyway, I'm babbling. Um, I'm gonna get ready to go to my appointment. It's just a doctor's appointment, but I do need to get an injection in my arm. In my arm. Um, and I need to order some meds and stuff like that. I'll get some more scripts, not order meds. Um, so that is what I'm going to do. I've, it's gotten a lot better that I can actually rest stuff on this side now, which I normally do. Like I go to go, I go to put on my bag, and I'm like, yeah, I can wear it on that side, but I don't really want to be resting things on that side. Because I don't want to dislodge anything. So. But it's not sore anymore, so I can rest bags and things if I needed to. Anyway, um, vlogging today. I'm excited. And yeah. Um, so I'm at the doctor's now. Um, I will update you after. I just wanted to say something that I forgot to say yesterday. When my nurse came, she said to me, Oh, she looked at my file and like saw like the list of medication, diagnoses, etc. And she says to me, But you're so young. And like, and you look so healthy. And it just aggravates me so much when people say that to you. 
because it's like what you can't be young and be ill you can't look healthy but not be like it's such like i know like the whole invisible illness thing but it's such like a oh it's one of those topics that just touches a nerve with me and it's just like like you're a nurse you work in this industry like why like don't be so naive kind of thing anyway just wanted to say that i don't know if tom's here or not here we go you just going to sit in your car <laughs> where is he that he's in there waiting for me <laughs> oh he's a little bastard all right anyway mission accomplished tom should be meeting me here i was gonna ring him and say go home and get his passport while i'm doing this but i bet you he's here i tell you Are you upset because your blood pressure was high at the doctor's? No, I'm not upset because I didn't get here before you. Mentioned it tomorrow. Oh, I didn't do just do it. Right, which way did you go? I was right behind you and then the stupid idiot that was behind you at the traffic lights yeah. went amber. Oh no, I'm like. <laughs> and I was like, I could have got through there as well. Of course. Uh, see you at mum's then? So cute, Bubba. I love you. Oh. Love you, baby. Basically, Tom's having his medical for his visa next week, and he we had he's been practicing his blood pressure to try and get it because he he has like white coat syndrome where his blood pressure goes high because he's nervous. So at the doctor's we had like a bit of a practice and it was high. Now he's all worried, but he'll be fine. He just needs to stop getting himself so worked up about it. Poor Bubba. Really. <laughs> Guys, I bought, apart from the snacks, I bought Harry Potter things and I have to show you later. Go on, it makes me look so fat right now. Oi! Recliner! Is that a two or three? Hey guys, so we just got home. Um, the film was so good, but it also left on a huge cliffhanger and I'm kind of just like, for God's sakes, I don't want to wait like 10 years for the next film. Tom's just stocking up the, try not to be too loud because they're sleeping, the drawers so we can do the stock take. I'm just about to get chained so I can do my TPN, um, but I thought I'd show you guys the shirts I got before I did. So, um, I was only going to get this one to begin with, but then it said um, if you buy one you get the second one half price, so I was like ugh. I'll get another one. So it just says Hogwarts, School of Witchcraft and Wizardry, and I think it looks really cool. And then it's got a bit of detailing on the sides and like the collar. And then I got this, which is like a Christmassy kind of one. And it just says Magic Christmas in kind of instead of Merry Christmas. And I think it's so so cool. So yeah, I think I'm probably gonna wear this one. I feel like it's it is kind of acceptable because Halloween's over, but I'd rather wait till December or the late November to wear this one. Oh, I'm out of breath. So, I'm going to wear this one. Um, and then set up TPN. And I will end my vlog tonight, I promise. But I'm going to get changed. <laughs> hey guys, so I'm, I'm remembering to end my vlog today. So, I've got the top on. I did buy it in a small, which actually fits pretty well, I would say. Because I didn't want it to be like really really baggy but I didn't want it to be like tight fitting because obviously I'm gonna wear it to bed or just like lounge I probably won't wear it out now but then again you never know um but yeah this is what it looks like and I really love it and I think when Black Friday comes around I might have a look I'm sorry that light's really glary I might have a look Black Friday um and see if there's any other deals Sorry, I'm, I really can't ever get the lighting right when I've got those lights on. Yeah, I might see if there's any good deals on Black Friday for stuff from there because I absolutely love the shop. It's called really? JJ's. I think it's next Friday. Oh. Which is good because I get paid from YouTube on the 21st, so I'll actually have some money. Um, I'm looking to try and buy an, a Nintendo Switch because mm -hmm. next year, yes I am, next year they're bringing out Animal Crossing, like a new Animal Crossing. And it's only going to come out on Nintendo Switch. So I really, really want to invest in one. So if there's a good deal on Black Friday, I'm going to get one. Um, so I'm going to end my vlog while I remember. Tomorrow is definitely going to be a rest day. I'm going to run more fluids. I want to try and get some vlogs edited and some other footage that I've got filmed, edited for a main channel video. <clears throat> there will 
excuse me, there isn't a main channel video for this Friday, but then I might upload one on over the weekend if I have time. <laughs> Sorry. Um, like I said, guys, the Fantastic Beast film was so good. A little bit confusing at times. I, w I don't know if I would go too far as to say it was better than the first one, although it was a lot more action-packed, but I thought there was a lot of stuff that was quite slower sometimes. I still loved it regardless, but yeah. Anyway, I love you guys so, so much. If you haven't seen the film, I definitely recommend it if you're a Harry Potter fan. And yeah, I love you all. And Everything <laughs> will be down below. Tom is not a Harry Potter fan. Well, it's not that he's not a fan, he's just not really ever read the books, or he's only ever watched the films once, so... You were a little bit confused, weren't you, Baba? Yeah. So I think he's gonna have to go back and re-watch the films, and uh, watch the first Fantastic Beast film before we go see the next film. Which will probably be like many, many years from now, but um, yeah. Love you all, everything will be in the description as usual. And I will, yes, see you guys tomorrow. Good night.